this is crazy. Now, this is where it gets a little spicy and gets heated up. There is a, uh, a, 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 I'm not sure who the person is, but they came out with a, uh, a movie of Mickey Mouse, Steamboat Willie specifically, because they know, hey, we can't be messing around with this new and improved Mickey Mouse that we all know and love today because that's still protected. However, the Steamboat Willie version of Mickey Mouse, copyright is expired. We're going to come out with a movie. And I'm going to let you know whether or not they should be looking over their back from a cease and desist letter or potentially a lawsuit from Disney as a result of this movie that they're looking to come out with. Let me uh, let me stop sharing here. I am going to uh, bring up the trailer in the movie. This is, a, this is a crazy This is a crazy movie. This is a crazy movie. Add to the stage. So this is, uh, again, 2024. You see it here. And this, M Mickey Mouse is like Michael Myers in this one, as you will see. I'm going to play it, and then I'm going to come back, and we'll talk about it a little bit. This is the best party that we can throw. <laughs> I've seen some rejections in my time, but, man, that was a good one. <laughs> There's blood all over the jungle gym. Blood. Yes. a horror movie. You never say, I'll be right back. Because then you don't. Think that's a great place to stop it at uh let me bring it back on me so you know this is it, it gets interesting so as you can tell this mickey mouse and they make it clear that it's steamboat willie based on the footage at the beginning of them showing steamboat willie that's quote unquote in the public domain but you can see this mickey mouse character uh at least in this movie that they're looking to come out with i think they said in march of 2024 plays this michael michael uh, michael myers character where he goes around killing people uh I'm not sure if you guys remember, but the Winnie the Pooh copyright, uh, I think it, it expired in 2022. And as a result, it was a similar film of Winnie the Pooh going around uh, the different versions of Winnie, Winnie the Pooh over the years, just killing people. And even though I'd never watched the film, but from my understanding, the film was a, a pretty bad film, but it only take $100,000 to make and it made $5 million. So I'm not sure if this, the owner of this you know, you know, film that the trailer of you just saw, is the same owner or a different owner, but it seems like somebody is trying to monetize in the same way, but they're missing one important point. The Winnie the Pooh character only had a copyright. It did not have a trademark. However, the Mickey Mouse character, including Steamboat Willie, also is trademarked by Disney. And as I said earlier, trademarks last forever as long as you are using the mark. So it'd be interesting, and I bet you, I can almost guarantee you that Disney is going to take, uh, you know, take issue with this. Number one, because you're using, you're essentially disparaging the Mickey Mouse character, the Steamboat Willie version of Mickey Mouse, which again they have a trademark on. You're disparaging it, which is a big no-no in trademark law. What disparagement means? You're 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 using it in a way that it it can affect the brand to the audience. So we all know Mickey Mouse uh, is a, a loving guy, somebody who teaches your kids and. Uh, is you know family oriented things like that, and now in this trailer, Mickey Mouse is going around killing people, which is the last thing that Disney wants associated with uh, with uh, Mickey Mouse, uh, whether it's the, the new and approved Mickey Mouse or the Steamboat Willie version. They don't want Mickey Mouse 
associated with going around killing people. So that is a disparagement of the Mickey Mouse mark. So as a result of it being also trademark, unlike the Winnie the Pooh uh, movie that wasn't trademark and therefore it, it was less recourse from Disney. The fact that Disney has that trademark on Steamboat Willie, that gives them this added layer of protection. And it'll be interesting because I can guarantee you that Disney is going to have an issue with this movie, particularly if it comes out. And uh, you bet your last dollar that they're going to at least send cease and desist letters to this uh, owner of this uh, short film or movie. And uh, I, would I wouldn't be surprised if they look to bring suit. Now, whether or not they are uh, victorious or not, that ultimately is up to the courts. <laughs>